How would you be if you were just coming up now, given what baseball is, uh, sort of the landscape there with pitchers? What kind of pitcher would you be? Well, uh, you know, that's that's really hard to say. You know, I think you grow up learning how to pitch one way, and, and as you get older and, and, you know, pitching starts to change a little bit. You know, I think, uh, you know, I was taught to throw strikes and, and, and uh, get hitters out in the strike zone, and, and now – Pitching is uh, it's kind of turned the other way where, where they try to get hitters out, out of the strike zone. So I think, uh, you know, I don't know if I would adapt it to that or not. Uh, you know, I'd like to think I could, but who knows what would have happened. But you came up as a pretty hard thrower. I don't know what your fastball topped out at, but, you know, if you're throwing 95 or 96 and then you, something changed and you became a different style of pitcher. Yeah, I think, you know, I threw hard, well, hard enough when I was, you know, younger. And, uh, you know, you learn that, you know, it's not so much velocity, it's location and the ability to change speeds. And, and I think, uh, uh, you know, I had a better chance to win if, if I if I pitched to locations to hitters' weaknesses as opposed to just wear back and let it fly. And you wanted to get the hitter. The hitter was going to get himself out. Like, like you didn't, I mean, that's how you won 18 gold gloves because you expected them to put the bat on the ball. Was that the, the strategy? Well, it, it just was the way it was. It wasn't necessarily the strategy. You know, I didn't really have swing and miss stuff, you know, so I, I had to rely on uh, uh, really trying to keep the ball in front of the outfielders. You know, I wasn't really worried about giving up singles and stuff, but I, I did what I could to try to keep the ball in front of the outfielders and, uh, uh, you know, not walk anybody and, and, you know, make them get three singles to score. Also, I look at these starters and it feels like if you go five, you did a great job. I mean, we have this quality start stat. Yeah. I mean, are we babying yeah. pitchers too much here? Well, you know, the quality start, you know, I'd love to see it be seven innings and three or less runs. I mean, you know, a four and a half ERA is, uh, uh, you know, it's about average, maybe slightly below average. You know, you think you'd like to, you know, have to do better in a four and a half runs a game to be considered quality, you know? For more Dan Patrick Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV or download the Dan Patrick Show app.